it because that has been a new Rahai update. <laughs> this outfit it is so cute, and yes, there is a new outfit and that is a new makeup look. But first of all, let me show you a new mood that there is. So if you come over here and you press on bunny, you can be a little bunny hopping around and it's so cute. And yeah, the movement's kind of weird because you don't move very much. You can just see your toe twitching slightly. But I just think that is really adorable. But anyways, now if we go to dress up and show you all the new hairstyles. Wait, no, not hairstyles. I already showed you them. But yeah, they have the names now. All of the update from trading is back. But yeah, you can see there are loads of new outfits. Wait, this is the same ones from before. Okay, never mind. So there's no new outfits, but there is new makeup. And look at these. They are so cute. And yeah, I absolutely love them. And I don't even know which one's my favorite, but I absolutely love this one and that one. They're just so cute. Okay, we're going to keep this makeup look. But yeah, um, something that has changed is the hide players thing is gone. And if you can see, next to the tick button, there's actually an eye. And then when you press on the eye, that's what decides whether you can see other people or not. Also, there has been an amazing update with the accessories. So if you press on it, you can see there are different options on what to do. The show all, equips to, type, is in, so do you want to just see the halos? Just see your hat, see your face, see your earring stuff, see your neck stuff, see your torso, see your handbag stuff, see the stuff that goes in your back or the stuff that goes in your feet. And then you can also press show all and also press seasonal, which is really cool. And this actually applies when you're wearing as well. Okay, no it doesn't. Before it was there, I'm pretty sure, but now it's not. <laughs> But anyways, yeah, that just looks really cool. And then you can see the outfits thing. Wait, what? Okay, there we go, yeah. So if you press on outfits, it comes over here. And then it says back to inventory. And you can choose an outfit to wear or create a new one. And you know what? We're going to save this outfit. We're going to save it as a cute bunny. Okay, there we go. And then we need to choose an effect to have. Ooh. Okay, we're going to have water splashes and splashes blue sparkles so if we say that name go back to inventory and we type in cute bunny and then okay if i could spell <laughs> cute bunny okay there we go we could be a cute bunny <laughs> yeah i absolutely love that that is so cool so yeah there also isn't just this update there are also some leaks that i just have to show and some of this could be out by the time I release the update. But first of all, if you come to the Roblox Studio beta, you can see there is a new option, which is trading settings. Allow users to send me trade requests, and you can turn it on or off, which is just really cool. So if you don't want people asking you to trade, you can just turn that off, and then they won't ask you, because they can't. <laughs> But yeah, I absolutely love that. That means if you have a halo and loads of people want your halo, you can just turn it off and people won't ask you for your halo because they can't. <laughs> okay, yeah, let's just go over to Twitter so I can show you everything else. Okay, so despite what I said, we are not actually on Twitter and that is because there has been another update to Rare High. And basically, if you open this up, first of all, credits to Rahe Ash, she's the person that let me know about the bunny pose, otherwise I probably wouldn't have noticed it. But anyways, yeah, if we come to dress up and you go to face and you go to skin colour, you can see it has completely changed and this is really cool. So there are all sorts of shades now and then of course you have the weird ones. Okay, but there we go. Let's just put on a skin tone. And then if you come to the custom eyes and custom lids, there are some new ones there. So you can see they're made by Lapsnet C. And we have this one and the male version of it. And then you can change the eye colours and they look so nice. But we're going to go for blue. And then if you go to the lips, there are also two new pairs of lips. And these lips, the male ones, you can't actually change the colour of them, but the female ones you can. So let's go for strawberry, and look at that. I am a pretty, pretty, pretty mermaid. <laughs> oh my gosh, I would never get over that April Fool's bio. But yes, we can be like a true mermaid. Wait, I just realised I'm missing something. 
the custom marks that's what makes us a true mermaid so yeah you can see there are two new custom marks and now we can truly be a pretty 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 mermaid <laughs> Oh my gosh, I absolutely love that. Also, do you like the seashell top? I think that looks really cool. But anyways, now let's actually head over to Twitter. Okay, so here I am, and I cannot believe this. Basically, I went to my second account this morning, and, you know, I was just seeing if I could win the Easter Halo, and then I found out that because of the inventory glitch, it actually gave me a Valentine's Halo. And do note, if you do get any extra items, like, they will go after a bit. But that is just so cool. I'm so glad to have that. As well as some other Valentine's accessories. So it seems like the game is glitching mostly with the Valentine's accessories. Because I haven't seen any glitched inventories with other accessories. But yeah, I'm really excited to be able to make a few, like, role plays and videos with the Valentine's Halo. Okay, so now we have some items in Kormir Bob's inventory, and yeah, I just made a tweet about it so I wouldn't have to go to Roblox and then go all the way and find it. But as you can see, we have heels test, so I'm thinking it could be that the heels are getting reworked, because I remember Night Barbie said something about that a while ago. She was saying about it getting done for like males and females and stuff, so it suit everyone. And then also we have the lily. And my prediction is that it will be for some sort of like summer halo because obviously Easter is over. The Easter halo will have to go and it will have to be replaced with another halo. So my idea is like it could be a sort of lily halo with loads of lilies going around and then some really cool cherry blossoms coming off. And yeah, that would just look so cute. But anyways, I guess we'll just have to wait and see what this lily's for. And then now we have a new place, which is called Secret Between Me and K-Car. And in case you don't know, K-Car is like the Fountain Stories writer. She writes all the stories. And thank you for K-Car for putting me in the story. But yeah, there is some sort of secret going on between Gorma Bob and K-Car. And I think it could have something to do with the fountain because she makes the fountain stories. But it could be something else. We don't know. <laughs> Now we have this lovely tweet from Night Barbie, which is how I found out about the new makeup and then the skin tones and oh my gosh, I love that outfit, it looks great. <laughs> and then now over here, we have some information about trading. And so you can see the message, the top one, says about some numbers that didn't make sense. And then he says that it now makes sense and that soon he shall return from his quest. And I think that means that trading is almost done. And I am so excited for when trading comes out so that I can trade with people, get some halos, get some other items as well. I am so looking forward to this. So next up, we have another tweet from Night Barbie, which says... Roblox's new shadow map lighting technology is so epic. I'm obsessed with the effect it's doing with Divinia's Gate. I'm watching the shaking trees move. It's not released yet to live games, but I am so excited to start building new rounds. To and agreed, that new shadow technology does look cool. Let's take a closer look at this photo. First of all, who is that? Because that is not called my Bob. Like, look how tall that person is. But yeah, you can see the shadows coming in from the gate. And then if you look closer, you can see the shadows below the trees. And that looks really cool. I am really excited for when this comes out. And also, Night Barbie said new realms. And I don't know what this new realm could be. But I am thinking it could be the mermaid realm I talked about before. Because she said about like the mermaid tails being completely redone. Although she may have changed her mind. <laughs> so yeah, I guess we'll just have to wait and see. And so now we have this tweet by YT Evelina and basically it talks about how there is about how they're preparing for trading and how they're giving your inventory the ability to hold more than one of the same item as you saw in the other tweet with Tsukimaki in it. And then it says that the dorm furniture locker slash decorations are temporarily disabled since like when you equip them you're kind of pressing to buy them and then you equip them through that so then yeah they need to work a fix to equip them instead of prompting you to purchase it again and also if you see items you never earned it's a glitch yep that includes my valentine's halo so i cannot keep it which is really sad but you know what it's okay 
so yeah i absolutely love this update and oh my gosh there is so much stuff night barbie has been talking about also did i show this tweet that showed about the shopping experience wait a minute <laughs> Yeah, I just remembered. This is why I retweeted this tweet. Because basically at the bottom it says next is the shop makeover. And I actually made a video about this already. It's called Ballroom or Boutique. And yeah, basically Night Barbie had said she'd have like some sort of shop place experience. And then it'd be like a try on button. So you can try on accessories and things before you've even bought it. And that was what I thought the mannequins were for. Like now you can see them wearing the skirts, but I'm pretty sure that isn't a shop makeover, is it? And now she's saying she's going to actually start making the shop makeover. When did she start making it? She started making it literally two years ago, which is so long. But yeah, I cannot wait for the shop makeover to be done. So we have a try on button. So now if I can't afford things, I can still show you all what they look like. But anyways, that is the end of the video. Make sure you ring the bell to be notified. You like and subscribe. And thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed.